a square. Okay, so let's do number four. Number four is the limit. We ought to find the limit of limit of n approaching infinity of n to the power of f to the power of n x. Now, and then, then they say in the terms of a b x. Now, what is f n x? We already uh, find it in the uh, number one. So that is f n x is a n x plus b of a n minus one over a minus one limit of n in, in, into infinity now how to find this limit technically we can actually uh, predict how this graph works you see that this is plus sign and you know that the property of limit we can actually separate this so n a a to the power of n x plus limit of n to the power infinity of a n minus 1 over a minus 1 right so the property you should remember the property of limit whatever the limit is and approaching 0 approaching 3 approaching infinity if you have this one this kind of uh, equation you can separate this to this form that way you can ease your calculation right so now predict the graph of a of a to the power of n not triangle i mean the curve let's say you got a squared how do you think the graph of a squared is it the graph of a squared even though the x i mean the a if you put it one square two square or even we put it in the negative direction minus one squared it will never it will never reach negative right the y equals a squared the y would not be negative that's why the graph would something would look something like this and even if the x is fraction right that's why the limit of a to the power of n is zero so we can put it zero here so limit of n to the power infinity of a and x is zero. What about this? We can say that b of a to the power of n. Remember, the n is used as the limit. And we know that the limit of a to the power of n is zero. So we can say that n limit of n to the power infinity of this is b of zero. I mean... We should do it like this. So b zero minus one over a minus one. So the limit of this equation of a to the power of n x plus b over a to the power of n minus one over a minus one is zero plus minus b over a minus one is equal to minus b over a minus one. So that is my friends the limit of n to the power of infinity of n to the power of n x and we express it in a b x well you might wonder where is the x well actually it's zero made by this limit it's okay just you know if they ask you in the answer in terms of something if that variable uh, doesn't exist just make sure that the variable should not be exist because in this case it multiplied by zero okay so the answer number four of the limit is minus b over a minus 1 or maybe we can change it into b over 1 minus a so that's it for the gakubu math 2016 part 3 okay so that ends our series of gakubu math 2016 and make sure guys to visit my website on solution examination.wixsite.com slash website remember to copy paste all the words there and that's just directly paste it in the model, in the in your browser and leave guys your message there if you want to recommend me of any other test solutions or any other comments that you want to make and remember like share comment and subscribe to this channel and of course just await for my new uh, video solutions and thank you for watching